YouTube, what's going on? It's your boy. I'll be back with another video. And as you see by the title, as you see by the thumbnail, we're at another show. So in my last video about the show where I think I did pieces under a thousand, thank you, rifles and something, under a thousand. So basically today, what I'm gonna be showing you guys is things that I think that are decent under 500, but we gotta hurry up and get in there because things under 500 are not gonna last long. So let's hurry up and get in this line. Over here, I found something a little weird. So this is a 22 long rifle Mauser, looks like AK. Mauser, that one's at 400. Then we got a 762 by 39 AR at 540 with a side charging handle. I mean, that's decent. That's decent, I think. For the price, we got a 300 blackout 16 inch barrel right there. 580 for that one. So first we're gonna start off with this Sig P320. I mean, this one is good at 574, but I mean, that's a really good value. That's a really good firearm right there. And so we're gonna stick to it at 500. So 599 is gonna be our cap. Next, we got this Gerson. You can't go wrong with a 1911, especially at that, that price, 439. We got another Rock, I think that's a Rock Island. Yep, Rock Island, 519, only has a 10 millimeter. We got a G36, 549, 550, and 45 ACP. Next, we got that Glock 27, that 40 Smith & Wesson at 487. That's a really good price for that. Nice little cup to a carry piece. Got a 23, slightly bigger version. And that one's at 487. So, I mean, Glocks are gonna run that all day. And those, I think a Glock is gonna be your best value at that price point. But also, we got the Smith & Wesson EZ. Smith & Wesson EZ is a really good firearm, especially for people starting off, especially the ones with the thumb safeties. I know a lot of people is concerned about, you know, safety when they're first starting off. So this one has the most safeties you can ask for. This one has a thumb safety, has a grip safety, and does it have a trigger safety? Nope, doesn't have a trigger safety. But this one's gonna have a super easy slide to rack, and a mag the magazine loader on this one is super easy to, you know, manipulate. We got another Smith & Wesson. That one's at 369. Oh, and by the way, this dude, has, basically he advertises it as having the best prices in the show. So, I mean, that's why these prices you see are really gonna be good at this table. Got another Shield 9, 344. That one's actually pretty decent. That one's actually pretty decent. Equalizer. A lot of people ask me to do a review on this one. I don't know what y'all think. Y'all think I should grab this one? A lot of people ask me to do a review on this one. Optics ready. Got a thumb safety, grip safety, and this one's coming in at 469, 469 for that equalizer. And barely making that cut is that Canic Rival. Man, that's a good price for that, 594 for everything you get with the Canic, and you get looks out the box. Like, come on, I think this comes with a holster in the box too. So, I mean, you cannot beat that. 594 Canic Rival. This is the all new one. This one just came out this year, so. So at 588, we got the Walter PDP. I mean, Walter's a really good brand. I mean, I like my um, Q5 match. I haven't really tried this one personally, but I know Walter is a definitely a good brand. Now, you already know CZ is going to be a good brand. Like, you know, CZ, they definitely do their thing. And this is all still frame. So really, this feels really good in the hand. Really good in the hand. And that one's at 578. CZ 75. Here we have a Glock. What is it, 45? Glock 45 chambered in nine millimeter. It does have a threaded barrel. Um, I don't like the black sights on it, but it does have five sights in the barrel. I don't know, this is a decent deal. This is a decent deal, especially you got that threaded barrel at the end. And here's another one, in case you don't want the threaded barrel. And that's a regular one, it's got different sights, yep. That's the typical Glock sights on the back of that. So as you see, most of the Glocks are gonna drop in that category. So if you're looking for a pistol at that price range, Glocks is definitely a place to go. So all the Glocks are definitely gonna be at a good value. Some you can even get under 500. And we also got the SIG P365. That one's coming in at 587. XL 587. So, I mean, those are definitely a good budget. P365. This one's coming at 489. Decent piece. I'm liking those sights on there. That one's coming in at 498. 
$4.98. I don't know if I said $4.89 on that one. And this barely making the cut is the $5.99 to pick that SIG XL, P365 XL. Now this, this got the exact same feel as the macro, just got, I think, a smaller grip and less rounds, but this is a good value at that price, $5.99. Next, we got a Springfield Armory Hellcat, that bronze slide, super high viz front sight. It's a really good deal right there. Also, we got the Springfield um, Hellcats that come in this little kit. It's on the 519, 538, and the spotted one's at 579. So, all at that $500 mark. And also, we got these Gersons. These are really good guns. Honestly, I didn't think these were going to be good guns until I actually shot one. These are really, really decent shooters. Ran by this little baby rock. From Rock Island. I know I like my Rock Island BBR. That 45 double stack 45. That's super compact. So this will be a really nice piece. Really small, compact 1911. That one is coming in at 379. And then we obviously got these Ruger LCPs. All gonna be under the 500 mark. We also got that SIG P322. So I mean a lot of 22s are definitely going to come in at that price right in case you want something to plank with but 22s is also a really good self-defense round i mean shot placement is key walter this one's coming in at 498. obviously we're going to have these little diamond backs these things are going to add 219 super small and there's two finishes one with a brown lower one with a black and then we got two Palmetto State Armories. This one's at 539, this one's at 529. I mean, you cannot be a lifetime warranty that Palmetto offers. So I mean, these are definitely a good value. I know a lot of people had, you know, split opinions about Palmetto State, but for that price with a lifetime warranty, I mean, you really can't beat it. You also got a SIG P320. This one's coming in at 499. And she also informed me that these are going 25% off this price. So, I mean, $25 off this price. So, all coming in at that mark. And the FN, I forgot to mention the FN. That's it. The 503. Really? This is the 503? I have one of these. This is a really good gun. That's a really good gun. I have the one that has the flashlight attached to the frame. Obviously, we're gonna have these Tauruses. This one's coming in at 379. Taurus is going to be a really good value at that price because you get a lot for your money with the Tauruses. This is their new competition pistol. This is their competition pistol, right? So, decent price on that one. Okay, so which one is this one? That's the A-Rex Delta uh -huh. the M2. It's optic ready. Comes with, a, I think, four plates. Okay. Comes with a 17 and a 15 round mag. It's got the flat trigger. Uh, ambi controls really good little gun for the money and mm -hmm. it's 50 bucks off today 50 bucks off that price it's not bad it's not bad i mean i i don't know a lot about it but i mean she seems to know a lot about it so i mean that's a good value for that so we have another 556 in this black and orange finish this one's at 595 and these little ar especially for the price so you can't really complain at that price okay so we got another 300 blackout this is a 10 inch this one's going at 585 we got a 223 this one is 555 and 530. I mean, some decent, some decent ARs. So we got the Shockwave looking 12 gauges. That one's coming in at 499. That's a good value. Same as this one, 12 gauge. And also the Mossberg Shockwaves, 599. These things run. We got the 502 at 599. So the Springfield XDM Duty Elite, that one is at $599. I love my Springfield. And this one's optics ready. This one does come with a flat face trigger, trigger safety, and a grip safety. So we have the Taurus. This is a G4. That's got a $50 rebate on it. Oh, really? From you guys or from the factory? From factory, you sent, you go on the internet, put your receipt in, and they send you a Visa card. And That's this crazy. one's got a $25 rebate. Is that 429. They also have the equalizer over here for 529. 529. We've got a Taurus coming in at 425. Uh, 
579 for that CZP10. Obviously, you can't go wrong with a Canon coming in at 580 with that distressed white finish on it. Another Canic TP9. This one comes optics ready. Flat, well, semi flat trigger, trigger safety. This one feels really good in the hand. Honestly, that one feels good. Obviously, we got the Glock. That one's at 550. This one is. Oh, this one's chambered in. Glock 17. 9mm. 329. We didn't do a lot of shotguns, so. One is coming in at 329. This is a 20 gauge super compact shotgun with a pistol grip. And we have the Mossberg 590. It's the Shockwave coming in at 469. The Remington version of the Shockwave. That one's coming in at 487. Then we have a Radical AR 15 coming in at 549. ATI AR-15 5.56 coming in at 499. That's a good value. Full size rifle. Another full size shotgun Mossberg. This one is coming in at 320. I think this is a 12 gauge. I'm thinking. We got a Springfield XDM. That one's coming in at 599. The FDE with the threaded barrel. XDM Elite, that one's at 577. It's a really good price. Another XDM. There's some decent prices up at that $500 mark. Smith & Wesson. Glock 48, MOS 527. You see his office ready, MOS. Obviously we got the Hellcat coming in at 599. A lot of people love them Hellcats. Also got an ATI 489 full length rifle. Oh, would it be a party with invited without inviting that high point there? Coming at 349. What's that? 349? 349 high point. YouTube so as y'all see you could get a lot for a little bit so 500 isn't you know a super huge budget you're not gonna get everything but we did find AKs we found ARs we found pistols revolvers shotguns you can get a little bit of everything so 500 is not a crazy budget but I know a lot of people was wondering could you find some nice items for $500 and at the gun show definitely you can so as y'all see it is starting to rain right here well it's not too bad but it, it is starting to sprinkle a little bit so I'm gonna go ahead and get out of here but like I said in the beginning if you haven't yet subscribed to the channel make sure you hit that subscribe button hit that like button leave me a comment share the video and I'm out Whew.